Good morning. Monday, March 21st. Start of day three. It's chilly. I'm trying to beat the crowd. Gooch Mountain Shelter is where I left from. And we're heading to Lansing Creek, I believe. Uh, another eight mile joint. So this is my third eight plus miles. Uh, a little tired. My knees are what's worrying me because they're sore. They're bad coming down hills last night. And uh, we got in early, which is nice. But uh, this morning I can feel it already. And I'm not even going downhill. So would have been a nice day for a, a zero, I think. Um, I'm trying not to push it, but got a good gang I'm with, so it's only eight miles. Um, I'm kind of hoping I can make it to Neil's Gap with them, because they've hung out with me the entire time. Um, and I'd like to take a shuttle back to uh, Above the Clouds Hostel. I think that's what it's called. Might have the words mixed up. Anyway, uh, I think I might have my trail name. It's kind of a long story, but I'll try to make it quick. Uh, Ron's shuttle took me from the airport to the hotel and from the hotel to Springer Mountain. And in, in the shuttle jumps a gentleman named uh, Grey Dog, which I've talked about. And uh, very kind, gentle, positive soul. Almost spiritual in a way. Um, doesn't tell anybody how to do their business, but very helpful. Um, we got out of the shuttle together, and he says, Hey, I know you. You're Kafkuba. You're from the Kafkuba. He didn't have the name quite right because probably not, you know, top of his list of uh, things he watches on YouTube or anywhere. But he remembered me. I was like, Man, I'm in the shuttle with a guy. First guy I meet. Come out of the, come out of the, uh, the Jeep. So we go up to Springer Mountain more or less together, not really paying attention to one another. Came back down, turned around. Ended up going back and forth and leapfrogging with them and, and Scotsman. And uh, bo kind of bonded. Talked. Um, talked about a lot of things. Um, and he was the guy that bailed me out at uh, Hawk Mountain Shelter with my uh, filter. Sorry, filter hosed up so he's been kind of holding my hand and getting to know him over oh, just a period of two days he comes up to me while i'm setting up my camp yesterday very kind and man, kindly manner whispers to me i'd like to suggest you a trail name he's from north carolina i don't really have the accent down he goes you know you're, you're always asking questions you're inquisitive um you like to understand things you like to get to know people for who they really are. I just want to suggest that you can think about it. Trail name Words. And I was like, right away, I was like, what is this guy, God? He's like, uh, you know, because I'm about words anyway. I got this stupid YouTube channel where I, I kind of said right away, I was like, the New York in me comes out. Oh, why? Because I talk too much, kind of joking around. But it really kind of hit me. At the same time, I was very thankful. But I got to throw a joke in there because I'm kind of self-deprecating and uh and right away i kind of said that's it you know because i'm into literature and all that crap and music and writing and and, and i like to philosophize and i like to talk to people and I'm like damn that's it i said i'll sleep on it and i knew i knew all night i was going to be it so the only thing i was worried about is like you know are people going to pick up on it words like what but i told scotsman Hey, he goes, uh, Grey Dog gave me a trail name. He goes, oh, yeah, what is it? I said, words. He goes, yeah. I said, why, can I talk too much? He goes, no. And I was like, everybody's getting it, so that's cool. Anyway, I've already gone on for almost five minutes. Uh, I, I can't upload these videos. The reception sucks, so uh, you'll have to catch it up in bulk. See you later. This was my original plan. It won't be long now. Well, end of day three. Making my uh, fettuccine Alfredo dinner. That sun goes down quick. 
I learned something today that probably everybody knows, but I guess they say 6.30 is midnight in, uh, on the trail. It's hard to get used to. All right, I'll talk to you guys later. Neil's Gap tomorrow. We're at uh, Gerard's Crossing. Gerard Gap Crossing. It's kind of a makeshift place. See ya. Night three. Ooh, I'm getting dehydrated and ancient. I've got my battery in one pocket. I keep this phone in the other. Keep the batteries warm on my chargers. I've used both for my kids. I like them both for different reasons. One's battery, one's rechargeable. And I don't care what anybody says, I like that confidence. At least I can always recharge one. Where the hell did my pillow go? Ah, oh, it gets so lonely at night.